Hey, it's Wolf. Um, I want to show you guys uh, how to set up um, radius markers for Aka. It's really simple. Uh, it sh what it does is it shows you the true tell of the Aka that is fighting you or you are fighting. Uh, as we know, Aka has three different NPC IDs, and uh, we're gonna mark every one of them according to their style. So what you're gonna see is uh, when Aka is using ranged, uh, you will see a true tile that is marked green. And if it's mage, it's gonna be blue. If it's melee, it's gonna be red. All right, let's uh, get into it. First thing, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to the plugin hub, which you can find on the little um, setting icon, and you go all the way up to the bottom. It says a plugin hub. You click there. You type in radius markers. Uh, radius markers, you just install this. Uh, you go back, type it in again. Radius markers, because the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to the settings of the radius markers. We're going to turn everything off from these marker features. Features. Um, so you're gonna just turn everything off and uh, accept the last one. The last one is the one that we're gonna work with. Uh, I've seen people also include this one. I am, to be honest, I am not really sure if you'd want this. Uh, I've no idea what it does. Whether the marker should have an attack range parameter. No idea. I've never used it, so I'm gonna turn it off. Um. Some other thing, you can change the border width, I think it's standard, like normally it's on 3, I changed it to 1, because that's how I always use my, uh, my tail markers, they're always on 1. Uh, you don't have to change anything else, uh, just copy what I have right here, so 1 radius 5, this should all be like this. I think it's standard like this, if not you can change this. Uh, I think the only one that might be different is, uh, is this one. The uh, interaction radius, uh, make sure to put it on one. Now that you turned everything off, you can go to this little icon right here, which is the radius markers. What you want to do is you want to click on this green little plus icon to make a new marker. It should look like this. If it's not like this, your settings are wrong. You need to change them. The first thing what you want to do is you want to come here to the NPC ID. For this one, we're going to use... um. Let's go for the mage first, uh, which is, uh, uh, the NPC is 11792. Just type that in there. Next thing what you want to do is you want to turn this one on. The interaction range should be on. Now for this one, the spawn point, you want to turn that off. You want to do that for everyone. So now we, we have this, and we're going to quickly rename this and call it Aka Mage, so I know which one it is. I'm gonna then uh, close this or collapse it so I don't accidentally change it. Uh, we're gonna make another one. We're gonna call this uh, range, Aka range. Uh, oh, oh, by the way, I forgot. Uh, you, you can change the color of the tile you want here. Uh, so this one was range or mage. So we're gonna I think I'm gonna pick blue for this one. Uh, sorry about that. Yeah. So after you change it, you can collapse it. Uh, for this one's gonna be range. The ID of it is gonna be eleven seven nine one. Uh, again, turn this one off. This one on. Change the color. At do something you'd like. This is range, so this is fine for me. I'm gonna add another one. We're gonna call this Aka uh, Melee. Uh, we're gonna change the ID. It's gonna be 11790 for this one. Uh, again, turn this off, turn this on, change the color to whatever you'd like. This is melee, so I'm probably gonna pick somewhere like a, like an orangey, reddish, just like that. That's fine. Alright, now that should be fixed and turned on. Now you will see the true tail markers. Uh, I will actually go into a raid right now and I will show you what it does. Alright. Um, here at Aka, 
Um, from outside of the room, you cannot see it. Uh, it'll only show up once you go in. So uh, let me just uh, change to my mage gear. Let's uh, just go in. And you see, this is what he does. Um, so it shows you the outline. Right now, I just know it's melee. Um, I'm just gonna wait. See now, it turned green. So I know it's green. You can just spray against it. That's all you have to do. Change this real quick. All right, there we go. So yeah, this is what it does, guys. Um, I'll just wait until it uh, changes the mage real quick. There we go. White, yellow, white, yellow. All right. What are you gonna do? All right. There it goes. He switched to mage. So the only thing you have to know, um, keep notice of, uh, it changes fast. So when right now I have the stay vigilant um, invocation on, and uh, what it does is watch this so right now it switched right but it still did a mage attack so keep that in mind you will see it way earlier so if you're too fast you will get hit if you're too fast with switching so keep that in mind guys other than that this is basically it and uh i hope that helped and yeah see you guys